What is up everyone? C Chad Run here coming at you from my storage room. This is actually the second video I've done from the storage room. But today I am bringing you a battle of the handheld soft flasks. We'll do a little comparison between the units that I've used. So stay tuned for that. In today's video, I'll be reviewing three handheld soft flasks that I've used specifically made for runners. The Solomon Pulse Handheld, Nathan Exodraw 2.0, and the Hydra Flask Sky Flask Speed. Each of these three units have their pros and their cons. Best of all, each soft flask is actually made by Hydra Pack, which is a very good thing. They are the industry leader when it comes to collapsible uh, soft flasks and that makes me very happy to know that they are the ones actually making these products. Even though each of the soft flasks are actually made by Hydropack, they're repackaged in a different way by the respective brands offering some cool and unique features. Let me know down in the comments if you use a handheld unit and if you do, which one have you used? Do you like it? Do you not like it? And what other units should I check out? Let me know down in the comments. Also, if you're new to the channel, please take a moment to subscribe. All right, let's dive into the comparison of these three units, starting with the Solomon. The Solomon Pulse handheld retails for $40. However, it is not currently available on Solomon's website. Uh, so you'll have to find it through some other third party source. It has a capacity of 500 milliliters or 17 ounces, and it uses the same soft flask that Solomon used to offer on all of their hydration packs. Now the biggest advantage to the Pulse handheld is how you use it. So it fits a lot like a glove. You just slide your hand right into uh, the unit there, pull that strap down, uses Velcro, and voila. In fact, you don't even have to grip or hold on to it. You can just loosely uh, secure your hand around it. And then you run with it and there you go. There you have it. Stop, take a drink. It's very, very convenient, very easy to use. So that, that's one thing that I absolutely love about this unit is how it, it, your fan fits into, uh, into it. I also really like that it features a large pocket here on the side. So this pocket is big enough for, uh, you can put car keys and gels. Uh, it's even big enough for most large phones. So I've used this on my Pixel 4 XL and now my Pixel 6. P uh, that's the same size roughly as a Samsung uh, S21 Ultra. You can fit a large phone in here, uh, no problem. And so if you wanna carry your phone, you need to get some tunes, you want it for pictures, you know, you gotta get the pictures for the gram, or uh, for emergencies, whatever it might be, you can fit a phone in here, which I, I really like. The material here is also made of a ripstop, so it's very durable. I've had this unit for about two years and it is still holding up quite well. I'm very, very pleased with it. The other thing that I really like about it is the soft flask itself has a lifetime warranty through Hydropack. So if you ever run into an issue where uh, there's a hole and it starts leaking, uh, you can get that replaced for free by Hydropack under that warranty. Now, as for the cons, if you are uh, big boned, big wristed, uh, this strap might be, you're gonna have to pull that a little tight. It might be a little small for uh, those of you that have a larger hand, a larger wrist. Uh, it works fine for me when I'm not wearing gloves. It's maybe a little tight at first uh, with gloves on. Uh, as you start to drink it, the water of course, then that uh, becomes less of an issue. But just know that if, if it's full of water, and you have a big arm, arm and wrist uh, hand, then that sizing might be a little problematic. Speaking of sizing, you do have a couple loopholes here that you can put the strap through, um, your small, medium, large. I've just left it there in the medium setting and that seems to work pretty well for me. 
The only other con to the Solomon Pulse handheld unit is that as you drink it, this part of the handheld may kind of flop around a little bit. Um, it's not a problem if you have a phone in there because that adds a lot of rigidity to the handheld, but just know that as you're running, this part might flop around just a little bit. Um, not a big deal, but it's there and sometimes noticeable. So that is the Solomon Pulse handheld. Let's move on to the Nathan XODRAW 2.0. Little disclaimer, Nathan did send me this unit for the purpose of review, hence why I'm bringing you this video now, but I am not getting paid to say anything. All thoughts, opinions, and experiences are truly my own. All right, now for the XOJAW 2.0, this is a 535 milliliter or 18 ounce unit. Retails for $45 on Nathan's website. Some of the advantages or pros that I like about this is this material. It's very soft. It feels really good in hand. Um, it just works really, really well. The strap, you're gonna have a Velcro option so you can size that uh, accordingly. As already mentioned, the soft flask itself is made by Hydropack, so that's very good. It's gonna be durable, it's gonna last a lifetime. Another pro that I really like is this pocket. Now, this pocket is good for fitting gels in there. I've uh, packed my keys and a gel in here. Um, it's the right size, I would say the perfect size, if that's all you need. As for a con, the pocket is not big enough, of course, for a phone. So if you need to carry your phone with you, eh, this may not be the handheld for you, unless you have another way of carrying your phone. Another con is that the strap may not work well for small hands. I mean, I've got this on about the, the tightest setting, and it's just about right for my hand. I don't know that I'd go any tighter, uh, but uh, you know, my medium-sized hand uh, fits well with this. Now, it is worth noting that this is their 18 ounce version. They do have a smaller 350 milliliter, I don't know what that is in ounces, but 350 milliliter unit. Uh, so a little bit smaller of one is available. Um, so that could work out really well if you do have smaller hands or you don't need to carry a half a liter of, of water around with you. So I've been using this for two or three weeks now regularly and have really, really come to enjoy it. Uh, it's just easy to use, easy to slip your hand in there, easy to hold, uh, and like all the soft flask units, they collapse as you drink it, so you're not gonna get sloshing of water. I also really like the Nathan unit over the Solomon, simply because the cap here is their 42 millimeter as opposed to the 26 millimeter. Uh, nozzle or, or head there. So when it comes to these two units, the Nathan is definitely going to be a lot easier to clean. I mean, it's quite hard to uh, take the cap off, unscrew it. It's even more difficult to pull the actual soft flask out of this unit, making it very difficult to clean. The Nathan unit's going to be much easier to clean. All right, moving on to the final one. The Hydra Pack Sky Flask Speed. Now what makes this unit so amazing is its minimalist design. This guy retails for $24 on Hydropack's website and this particular unit is 350 milliliters, but you can get it in a 500 milliliter variant. As I mentioned, it's the minimalist design that makes this unit so great. Uh, it's very simple and can be very compact. So I've used this uh, on some longer runs when I bring a hydration pack and when I just wanted a little bit more water. So I would use this first, I would drink all the water and then I could simply smash that down and throw it in my pack. It's very lightweight, didn't take up very much space at all, which is very nice. I also like that this unit is cheaper than most handhelds, uh, certainly cheaper than the other two. And last but not least, the other phenomenal feature about this guy is that speed cap. So you can just pop that open, fill it up, whether you're, you're making a quick stop and at an aid station or you just want the convenience of having a, a cap that you don't have to unscrew. Fill that up, close the cap, easy as that. I love that. 
As for the cons of this unit, uh, the biggest con really honestly is, is this strap. So it's not Velcro, it just stays in place through friction. Um, so that may not work if you, again, if you have small hands and you need to really cinch down on, on the strap there. Uh, for me, I just kind of left it there, worked fine, never had an issue with it uh, slipping out of my hand. So these are the three units that I use regularly. Again, I use the Solomon Pulse if I need to bring my phone with me. Uh, it's got that big pocket, which I really like. The Nathan is just simply convenient and works really well if you want to bring a gel or you need a place to put your keys. And then again, the Hydra Pack, it works so well because it's simple. It excels because of its minimalist design, if that's really all you need. So thank you for joining me on this little uh, soft flask review video. Appreciate you guys being here. Don't forget to subscribe. And again, drop a comment. Let me know what uh, handheld water unit you use, um, if you even use one, and uh, what you like and don't like about that. And lastly, as we end all of these videos, be consistent, express gratitude, and enjoy every mile. I will see you guys on the next video. Thank you all. Bye-bye. Oh,